How's it going, guys? Dre here, and welcome back to Green Hell. Today, oh, God, Jesus! <sighs> what? Why? Freaking attacked by a damn parrot right when we start. I can't see a damn thing. I'm thinking there's tribal people around here. God damn it. Anyways, uh, we're back in Green Hell, guys. We're in the survival mode once again, playing a good old normal game of survival. Now, today, we're going to continue working on our camp, trying to basically make this thing as good as possible. I want to make sure we can survive for a long period of time, and we really did find a good spot to do that. So, main focus I want to do today is make sure our fire is okay. I'm going to put up, let's actually, well, I can't really see right now, but once we can see, I'm going to put down the upgraded hut, and we're not going to use that one to sleep. We're just going to use that as a way to keep our fire safe. I want to see if it works. You guys were saying in the comments that it does, so hopefully it does because uh, I'm trusting you. What are what's all these big stones always around my place? I mean, I'm not complaining. I get free stones, but oh god. What? What? Did, what? Okay, we're just going to take a million stones for the, to start this. That's all right. I want to get some coconuts later, so hopefully we can hit, we can hit a few out of the tree. But yeah, I'm thinking over here we'll put the other big hut down, so let's uh, waste no time, get into it, uh, and actually do this. The small shelter, as it's called. I wonder if there is bigger ones. Oh, we can do bamboo shelter. I never even noticed that the one uh, is different. We haven't actually found a bamboo forest yet. I haven't done much exploring intentionally, because I want to make sure we're okay here before we focus on doing that. But, um, okay, this is going to be harder to put down than I thought, because we got a lot of crap around. This thing's huge, man. All right, I think I'm going to have to clear-cut some forest or something to figure this out. Let's do that. Seriously, where did all these freaking stones come from? I have 15 stones right now. Uh, Macaw meat is raw, so we should probably set up that fire soon. I don't know why there's a stick here. I'm not what, the what happened here? Like, seriously? I don't remember what we were doing, but goddamn, I have a lot of crap around here. This should fit... Oh, my God, another one? Okay, I'm going to max out on freaking stones here. We have 20 stones now. Great. Uh, all right, we got some water at least. Let's drink that. I don't remember it raining, but hey, I'm not complaining. And now the one downside is now that we have all this material, I am I can only hold four weapons at a time. So, oh, actually, we should probably go into my inventory here and craft a stone blade. Because then we can make an axe. I don't actually have an axe around, I don't think. So there we go. So what we're going to have to do is we just have to kind of organize this later. I'm gonna have to have like a storage area because I can only hold so many spears. You know what? Should I put the fishing spear? Just in case the tribesman comes, I think it's smart to keep the obsidian spear on me because that should be the best weapon. All right, so we should be able to chop this, right? Yeah, okay. I'm just thinking maybe if we can fit my um, fire over here, this would be good. And this should actually give me, is there any dried leaves? So we get dried leaves, we can make tinder easily. Oh, we got one, actually. So there we go. That's free tinder. We don't have to wait for that. Uh, oh, actually, another one here. Oh, no, that one looked like it, but no. So the banana leaves will just have to get out of the way. Not really sure what the banana leaves are for. Again, they're supposed to... Let's actually try. Um, it's in the works that they're supposed to actually be able to be used as bandages. We can't even uh, harvest with them or craft with them. So, yeah, unfortunately, banana leaves I don't think are fully implemented into the game just yet. And that's a little bit too bad. Oh, what the heck's going on here? Now, this is this is all screwed up. I don't even think... I wanted to actually get this whole thing down, but I don't think it's going to work that way. So we might have to go up a little bit or just kind of reorganize around here because there's not really that much room. So just doing some organization. I want to try something. So we have leaf bandages here, and I think if we throw tobacco leaves... Yeah, we have tobacco dressing. This is for anti-venom. So we're going to have one of those. It actually should say... No, it just says tobacco dressing, so I guess we have to know what that is. Oh, that's obsidian stone. We want to keep that. Uh, but yeah, that is for anti-venom. So now we don't have to worry so much about snakes. And I'm just going to throw a crap load of rocks here because we obviously have a lot of them. And I need to uh, organize a little bit. Dry leaves. You know what? Let's actually... We had some raw meat here. Is it spoiled yet? It is raw, so let's actually get cooking. Just to get some uh, space in my inventory. It hasn't rained in a while, so we're pretty lucky. Hopefully it doesn't rain the moment I do this. Now, this is going to use some energy, but we got lots of that right now. We're good. Light this thing up, and you know what? Maybe we should try and make some soup. I Oh, crap. I used all the water in my bowls, though, so I'm going to have to wait for more rainwater. I can't just fill the bowls with bad water. That would be ba a bad idea. Oh, more dried leaves. Okay, I was trying to get rid of inventory space, but that's all right. Yeah, you know what? I'm just going to go for a fish, I think, here. Should be relatively easy to do. We got fish. Well, I thought we had fish all around here. Where'd my fish go, man? 
That, that, that would suck if we uh, eat all these. Okay, here we go. Here we go. We got some guys down here. Come on. I think I got him. Did I get him? Oh, my God. I couldn't even see, and I got him. Okay, let's uh, harvest that and get this down so we can get some meat in our uh, diet. All right. Unfortunately, it did start raining, so that's going to be a common occurrence. Um, we have our meat almost cooked, though. Aha! Okay. I put it down before it would go away again. So check out this. This is actually going to be really good. So we got... We can move our fire over there. We're going to need to build this real quick. So let's do that first, I guess. We can collect some stuff as well. Uh, we're getting a lot of stuff right now. Actually, before I forget, there's just so many things going on. So we have water in here. I think they have to be filled, though. So I'm not sure if they're filled. Let's uh, make the fire once again if I have some tinder in here. Okay, I do have dry leaves. Sick. This is probably going to be something that happens a lot until we get this thing built. I'm just going to waste fires because of this damn rain. It rains so much here. Uh, makes sense. This is the rainforest after all, pretty much. All right, so I just want to get this meat cooked to help with my sanity a little bit. That's obviously something we constantly have to worry about. So there we go. Now at least we're cooking, and we can get working on this thing. So, yeah, we're going to need lots of palm leaves. we got dried leaves here. This is good. Okay, dried leaves are what I really want to focus on. I think I'm going to wait for this to cook just because I don't want to burn it. Uh, meat's very important, obviously. And unfortunately, a lot of our stuff is spoiling, so... Yeah, this is what we have to worry about. All my bananas! No! That, now, we don't want to waste these, though, because we can actually get grubs and stuff off them, I believe. So, we're just going to have a, a spoiled pile over here that we can check later and see. Yeah, but all these mushrooms, like everything. Oh, I even got maggots. E effects of consumption unknown. That doesn't sound smart. Oh, why do I... Why do I have a coconut in here? Oh my god, I can so use this. Alright, we're gonna eat that, eat that, because the more water we get, the better. Alright, macaw meat is cooked, and arowana meat is cooked. Fire's still going, so let's get another piece of meat on here. I think I also got, yeah, we got some lean meat from those scorpions we found. That's a big piece of meat for a scorpion, man. Uh, but yeah, we're gonna make a bunch of meat right now, and heal up a little bit. There we go. We got 10 energy, 31 proteins, and our sanity... I guess our, our head's good. Our head's right here. I think that means we're full, so we have no sanity at all right now. All right, but the more coconut halves we have on the ground, the more water we get. So that's obviously really good as well. We'll keep focusing on that. And there we go. Now we got four. Okay, and now with some food in our belly, we should have the energy to go chop some of these suckers down. So we got to get the big boys. We got to get the ones with the logs. Uh, is this big enough? I don't know. We should be able to get some long sticks, though. We're going to need those as well, so... Can't hurt to take it down. I think it's big enough for logs, though. Yeah, at least we'll get one. One, two. Not bad. That's actually all we need. So, perfect. Done that already. And there we go. What's up next? Long sticks. Lots of long sticks. And those should be easy to find. We got lots of those around here. All right. Got a full inventory. Five sticks. And we got lots of water coming in. So, that's good for hydration. I'm going to try and make stew today, too. I would really like to learn how to do that. So... Uh, yeah, today's all about just building up and surviving. So one more long stick and then lots of palm leaves. And that really wasn't that bad. It's not that hard to make the uh, huts in this game. What is... Oh, that's another big stone. I'm so sick of seeing big stones. All right, there we go. Give me one long stick. That's all I care about. And now it's time to play with palm leaves. I wonder why you can't use banana leaves. Oh, yeah, we have ropes too. Crap. We need lots of them. So I haven't been really looking for ropes too much. It looks like we had quite a few on us, so we still need three ropes. That should be pretty hard to find, or easy to find, rather. Small leaf pile there. Actually, if we leave that out, I want to see if that dries. So we'll keep an eye on that, because if we can just leave out leaf piles and dry them, that means more tinder for us. Okay, into the dangerous jungle to look for ropes. Now, yeah, we got ropes right here. There we go. I haven't really explored too much over here. You can see it's quite deep, and I hate going to areas that are covered with bushes, because... Well, anywhere there's snakes, and uh, I don't want to deal with snakes right now. Uh, I want to get a couple more ropes to just have some on me as well. This is the cave, so we should have our obsidian here. Yes, we can keep picking that up. I love it. We're just slowly going to have all obsidian weapons just because we live so close to a spawn. Uh, but there we go. We got more than enough ropes. I've already chopped a palm tree as well. Let's get back down. Yeah, I'm pretty sure everything's safe over here. I pretty much explored this all, and I think we're... We don't... Whoa! Whoa! Jesus. Okay, so I cut that palm leaf down, and it's going crazy. Uh, some of those went in the water. That kind of sucks, but we got lots here. Try and pick up some of these. Organize this a little bit. There's six right there. Bam, 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 bam. Oh, man, we're going to need lots, though. I forget how many. I think it's like 24 or something we needed last time. 
But once this is done, that means our fire is pretty much fully dealt with, which is obviously really good. A long stick randomly there. Uh, this should give us palm leaves. There we go. More leaves everywhere. Leaf explosions. Gotta love it. All right, so yeah, we don't even need to chop down a palm tree or anything. These things all around us have more than enough, I think. All right, I got two more. I hope I don't need to cut another one down. I think I need three, don't I? One, two, <laughs> of course I do. There's got to be another one somewhere here. I don't want to... Oh, there we go, right there. Perfect, look at that. And we are officially... Well, try, come on, I'm having a hard time placing the final one. This, is this not a palm leaf? Okay, well, there's lots of palm leaves. <laughs> What the hell? Where did these ones come from? I don't remember this. I got a leech on me. Hold on. Oh, I, I need another. Oh, that's right. I need long sticks on the top as well. Well, let's get this leech off me so we don't have to deal with that. Now, somebody said try and put it in my backpack. That's actually a great idea because I said we should be able to use leeches. Whoa. So we should have. Yeah, that's one right there. Uh, doesn't drag over. What is this? Oh, I had three on me. Well, that's not good. <laughs> Oh, I, I hope they all attacked me at once. That would have been embarrassing if those were on those. I'm on me the whole time. Okay, and I think this is it, right? After this, we're done. Oh, we actually only needed one. Perfect. Okay, so we officially now have a hut for us to use. Let's take that plank. Get this out of here. No space in the backpack. Of course not. Uh, so we're going to have to actually move this. Can I actually dismantle? I don't think I can dismantle it. So we're always going to have a fire there. We're just going to have to build another one down inside here. I wish you could move them. There might be a way you can... Not totally sure. Oh, God. Oh, don't tell me. Okay. I think that should be good, right? I mean, it's still underneath it. I think we're okay. All right, so we're going to have to go find... Never mind, we're not going to have fun to have to find sticks because I clearly collected a lot of them. But what I'm worried about now is one thing we are going to have to forage for is fruits. So the green is our fats, and then the yellow is our fruits. Uh, as you can see, we're doing all right for meat. Uh, surprise, surprise. But, yeah, we are going to have to go look for some berries and whatnot. And this is when it gets dangerous, though. This is when I don't want to die. Uh, once I pass this bridge, like, that's my comfort zone. Over there, over here is the unknown. Uh, but, yeah, we should be able to hopefully find something. What is this? Okay, those are the red flowers. Seen those before. It is getting dark out, so I'm not going to go too far. I was just hoping to find some uh, fruits kind of right around here so we can at least help my, bu my buddy a little bit. I kind of wonder if I should eat those maggots. They might be high in fats, but... Uh, they also might totally wreck my body. I have no idea. Okay. Oh. Okay, we do got some tribes people up ahead. This guy as well. You know what? Actually, let's um take this home for meat because why not? There we go. And hopefully we don't have to worry about that guy anymore. Going to get as many snakes as we can. Uh, still looking for fruits. I'm not finding any around here. I did collect a lot of them. I thought they would respawn, though. I love that you can reuse the arrows usually, too. Okay, okay. Come on. There's really no strange fruits around here. Got another river up this way. Look at this. This is beautiful. Uh, I'm not going to go too much further today just because of how dark it's going to be. Hopefully, if we wrap around this way, we can come back and find something. Well, I'm really good at finding random meat. Uh, well, no space in backpack. Okay, we got lots of arrows right now. I think I made, like, ten... And the fact that we can reuse them, I don't think we're going to need arrows anytime soon. Yeah, having inventory issues. We're going to have to make some sort of storage area. I guess I could store underneath my hut, too, but it's kind of hard. There we go. That's all I wanted was one uh, plant worth. Thank God we found that. Okay, so we got our fruits. That's what I needed. One thing we have to find, the best thing for fats is nuts. I have not been looking on where to get nuts. I don't know the, what, what kind of plants I should look for for those. Uh, but if we could figure out that, then we should do even better here. Uh, how far? Okay, well, we, we haven't really been this far, but I know exactly where I am, I think, so we should be okay. Actually, I wonder how much fat are in these mushrooms. Now, these ones look totally safe to me. I think we'll be okay. Famous last words, but I'm going to eat these just to see how much fat they give. Carbs. Okay. Unfortunately, what I'm looking for is fats. Lots of fats, but, I mean, we, we may, may as well eat these suckers since they're here. I mean... Any food is better than no food, so... Yeah. The the, the quest for nuts uh, starts, I think. We're gonna have to really find those. I really want to try the maggots, just to see. Because I can make a maggot farm. That'd be easy. Just have lots of spoiled fruit. Uh, or meat, rather. Let's eat the fruit, though. See, it's all carbs, though. It's not fats. We should get a little bit of fat out of the uh, meat, though. What the hell? Oh! 
bird nest. Okay, that's probably used for kindling. Wood resin. No idea what I could use that for, but uh, I'm happy to have it. Okay, let's, let's get back home. It's getting dark out, and I don't want, do not want to be out here in the middle of the night. Oh, look, another dead parrot. You know what? I'm just going to let that one go. I got so much meat on me, uh, I, don't, I don't even need it. I don't know what's killing all these parrots, but uh, you probably shouldn't eat something that's dead anyways. Okay, so this should be... Ooh. Oh, hey, look at that. Another coconut. That's something I didn't really look for was coconuts. Uh, the more we have of those, the better, too, because that means more hydration. All right, but good time to get back. I almost can't see, and last thing I want to do is fall off that log. Oh, that freaking moved, and that scared the hell out of me. I don't know if you can see that, but, uh, yeah, that was not fun. Okay, so we got a coconut here. We'll just drop that for right now. Let's get a fire started, because we can use that bird's nest that I found. At least I think we can. Where, oh, where did that bird's nest go? Uh, crap, maybe we can't. Wood resin? I can, can we use wood resin? No, we wouldn't be able to use wood resin. Oh, it's right here. Okay, so it, for some reason it went in this one. I don't remember it doing that before. Uh, it's pitch black out, but if we can get this fire started, at least I can cook some of this meat and see if this thing indeed does work. So ignite. There we go. We got a little fire, as you can see. This is nice. This is real nice. Let's eat this coconut. I don't actually know if the coconuts get fat, so let's find out. Drink that for some hydration. Harvest it. And give me the delicious coconut. Eat. Okay, that does have fats. All right, so coconuts are going to be easy to get. That should help me with the fats, then. That's really good. <gasps> Food poisoning. Uh, Wait, am, am, am I okay? Did, did I get food poisoning from those freaking mushrooms? Coconut shell with flesh. Okay, so we might have a problem here with food poisoning. I'm going to drop this mushroom. Oh, it glows. <gasps> oh. Oh, no, I'm vomiting. Oh, this is bad. I sh Man, you should always, you should never eat freaking mushrooms. I, I know that, too. They look nice and healthy, and now we are vomiting. So I got to figure out how to deal with this. My sanity's going up, at least, because of the fire, so that's good. Uh, this should hopefully keep me okay, but uh, crap. That is really not good. It looks like there's a timer on it. I'm assuming we just gotta let it go through my system. It's food poisoning after all. You just gotta rest and relax and hope for the best. That sucks though, man. I didn't want to get food poisoning. All right, so we got some uh, meat that's spoiled here. Man, I am just, okay, let's eat the cooked meat before that spoils. Get some fats, get something in my system because clearly I just puked it all out. Eating glowing mushrooms, that's no oh, crap. That's never a good idea. I'm getting really low health. This is kind of getting uncomfortable. Let's eat a little bit. And yeah, I think we just got to survive it. I do have something on me, though. Oh, crap. I'm puking again. I'm puking. Damn it. Oh, eating mushrooms was a stupid idea. Well, at least I know this thing works. My fire is still going and we're doing OK. But I really I can't die. I, I really don't want to die. That would suck. Let's throw some meat on the fire, I guess. And because that's all the food I have. I've ate everything else. There we go. We got a little bit of food. Um, let me actually drink some water. That might help a little bit. Yeah, there we go. Drink all the water, buddy. You're going to need it to get through this. Cause I got damn food poisoning. Now, let's go to my... Oh, crap. Should I sleep? All right. I have to inspect myself because I got something on me. Oh, God. This is bad, though. This is bad. I might die to food poisoning. and That would be majorly embarrassing. Crap. Okay. I think we're okay now. I'm hoping. Because if we puke again, we might freaking die. Okay, eat this. Take. Man, I'm trying everything I can to survive here, guys. Eat the... Oh, crap! I ate the wrong one. Now I got parasites? Why would it go on top of my other one? Oh, God. Okay, come on, man. Come on, it's okay. I totally screwed this up, man. I totally... Oh, God. Come on, hold it in, buddy. Hold it in. I... I'm so sorry. Okay, we got a little bit of water here. Uh, I'm not going to drink any of the bad water. Oh, my God. Look at my health. Look at my... I'm just vomiting in my, in my bowls now at this point. I've used all my food just trying to keep up my health. Let's uh, maybe eat these unknown herbs just to see. That gives us two carbs at least. And it might sell our stomach a little bit. Uh, tobacco leaves are for anti-venom. So that's not going to help. Oh, what else... Well, what else can I do? There's really nothing I can do here, guys. In a last-ditch effort, I'm going to try and sleep and help out myself a little bit. Maybe that might be what we need to do just to rest this off. We're either dead... Oh, shoot! We died! 
Alright guys, so uh, we're gonna wrap up this one here. Now, obviously I can load my last save and go back to where we were. What I think I will do is uh, build kind of to where we got off at the end of this episode and not eat glowing mushrooms this time. I honestly, I don't know how to deal with the food poisoning. I thought we could just, you know, rest and outrun it, but then I ate raw meat as well and that totally screwed up everything. It, it can end badly in this game really, really quickly. So. Like I said, in the next episode, we should have the same thing built as I did today. It's just, uh, yeah, we won't be dead this time. So, I apologize, guys, but I thought it was kind of fun anyways. Dealing with sickness in this game is uh, an interesting experience. If you guys have any suggestions on how I could improve when I get food poisoning next time, let me know in the comments below. I think i got to make, like, soup or something. Uh, maybe a stew. I think I need a special herb or something. I have no idea. I'll have to look it up. But uh, I was not prepared for that. Shouldn't have ate the mushrooms, guys. Never eat the mushrooms. Now we know. Regardless, thanks so much for your support, guys. Thanks for watching and liking. <laughs> and I'm sorry I died, but I'll see you in the next one.